5. Yep. <laughs> DSM, the DSM file is probably right. Wow. Minimize that. Okay, there we go. On account of the waveforms. On account of those waveforms. Uh, it's been a minute. What's up? What's up, Dumbo Nation? We had our work mandated uh, vacation. Uh, unfortunately, you know, we had to take a couple weeks off to listen. To yes. People, yeah. To, to really take some time to listen. And listen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. To sit down and listen. So that's what we've been doing. We've been doing a lot of listening. We got your letters, America. Um, we heard you loud and clear. We heard you loud and clear. <laughs> we want more episodes. <laughs> uh, I do think it's pretty funny that uh, the last episode uh, was titled "We Take on the Catholic Church," <laughs> and then. Uh, <laughs> And then we disappeared <laughs> for a few weeks. We fought the law on the law one. <laughs> Damn, Catholic Church yeah. got hands. Yeah, those of you not in the know in Dunder Nation, yes, our war against the Catholic Church did not go well. <laughs> they, or it turns out they're way more powerful than we thought. Turns out. Yeah, there's a lot of them. You know? Yeah. But um, if you know where to look, you'll find support. Um, I was on the inside of the Catholic Church. Yeah. I was in the, the belly of the beast. You went yes. right up to them. And you said, hey, Mr. Pope, I don't like how you run things. And he said, oh, shucks. He said, I like your gumption, kid, you're hired. <laughs> he said, he, oh. yeah, he said, uh, yeah, I was like, hey, Pope Francis, you know, what's the big idea? You know, <laughs> there's tons of um, Dunder Nation. I went to Italy with my family, by the way. I'm just kidding. I had to drop that in there. Um, oh, you but, went to uh, Italy? Let's yeah. cut that. All right. Um, what are your goals for... Uh, new season. It's a new time of growth and of change and learning. Yeah. Um, summer is over. Uh, and so what are your goals for like to keep mindfulness and being centered at um, the forefront of your uh, live practice? Uh, Jack, we try to keep this as an evergreen podcast. So you could maybe like make it more general, you know, make things more general. So, you know, well, people could be listening to this at any time of the year. Yeah. So if you could just make it more general, you know, something like, what what do you enjoy? Well The Falling Leaves. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So maybe make it a bit more general than that. Movies of Taika Waititi. Like for me, leaves. I enjoy I enjoy the color of the 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 foliage. The foliage um, that it is right now. Yeah. Um, yeah. The, those uh, the trees out there certainly have something. There's something. I like that um, when the leaves fall, yeah, I like when the air fall I... and a leaf falls in loneliness. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but time flies like an arrow. <laughs> I like that the I like when the air has a temperature. You know, like that's my favorite time of year is when like the air outside when is, the air is, is, is a certain feeling temperature. The way yeah, that it does. When yeah, it has a temperature. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, I like that the pumpkins outside are are uh, could be baked into a pie or could be. Uh, but a lowly seed, as it is not yeah. their time to bloom. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Order, That's... they're not in season. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I like I like that there are are not pumpkins outside. Uh, <laughs> there are or aren't. Yes, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Yes. Uh, uh, nope. We are uh, looking forward to fall. What's up, sweetie? Here. Yeah. yeah. Um. Excited Girl, for right outside. Yo, big news. <laughs> Big news. Did you guys see the new Star Wars 10 trailer? Oh, yeah. It's exciting stuff. You see everything that they put in it? Yeah. It, yeah. it makes sense that they bring they, they would bring that person back. Yeah. Especially given the context. You can't yeah. believe they casted Lizzo as a It's doubt. cool. It's, I think it's good that they that they brought Louis C.K. back. Yeah. Because, I mean, he's such a part of the right. Star Wars back. mythos. Yeah. Right. He's Watto's Not, boss. Yeah. Louis C.K., the character, also. Yeah. Is playing. He kind of sort of plays himself. He's like kind of the through line. line. Yeah, through all the movies. Yeah. It's weird that they go to a Dua Lipa concert on Jakku. Yeah, and it's not that weird if he makes if you if you know the books. Speaking of Jakku, I have a friend named Jack who uh, recently was in Italy. I was. Yeah. I was indeed. I was gone. Cut for... this. Cut this. <laughs> shut, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Glad to be back in redacted country where you can eat redacted foods. <laughs> yeah. I traveled to Italy from Redacted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally from, well, I can't really say that. And, yeah, I can't really tell. Yeah. You can't let them know where I am. New York City, baby. No, yeah. yeah. It, was, uh, it was good. Um, one thing I uh, 
don't like is that many of the toilet seats were square, which doesn't really make a lot of sense. Uh, well, it makes sense if you read the books. Unless they have, unless they have, <laughs> unless they have square asses out there. But, uh, you know, I, 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 after, after much thorough investigation, I could not come up with that. Um, didn't, didn't get any, didn't lay any pipe down there. Oh, you know, I, you know, let's just, let's just say, let's just say, no, let's just say, let's just say the day I left, they erected a, they, they elected a far right oh. government, so that's, you know, I, let's just say, let's just say I got in and out, you know, I, I did what I had to do. Oh yeah, that was you, right? It was You were behind that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> mostly. <laughs> mostly. Mostly. A little bit. A little me, a little bit of Putin, you know. Pooty as I like to call him. My yeah. friend, Vladimir Putin. <laughs> Speaking of Putin, um, we should be putting in more effort uh-huh. <laughs> on this. Um, okay, what is? Well, here's the problem: is that we've got this. <laughs> we've got this whole. Uh, well, I know you don't have anything. So, <laughs> <laughs> um, you're writing. You're writing the sentence after you're saying it. <laughs> um, here's the problem: is that we've got this. Routine of going to get fried chicken before recording, <laughs> being very sleepy, yeah. and then becoming. And it's like, oh yeah, it's great. We'll go get some fried chicken. Let's and go to sleepy's fried warm chicken. Warm up for the for the <laughs> podcast, and then we're just like sitting bloated with our belts unbuckled, yeah. uh, just covered in grease. Uh, <laughs> uh, you guys, uh, lay off me! I'm starving. Yeah, well, so it is National Star Chicken Wars? Finger Day. I know that's not evergreen, but no. Oh. I guess it's, you know, one person listening. Chris listening to this is going to love it. Yes. Shout out to you, Yo, Chris. Shout out, Chris. What's up? We're coming for you. Yeah, your, your, your <laughs> days are numbered, boy. Let's just, let's, let's every day reveal a different part of Chris's address. <laughs> <laughs> Three! <laughs> All right, we'll next week. Yeah, we'll next week. next week. Next week. Next week. <laughs> North. <laughs> no spoilers. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Um, okay, now here's a question. Uh, what should we, have we, have we started thinking about, um, <laughs> can see it. No, I do, I do have a question. Shut <laughs> yeah, the fuck up. No, the wheels are spinning. The wheels are kind of spinning. No, because I realized it wouldn't be evergreen, but I'm, but I, you know. No, it doesn't, just whatever. Um, uh, don't, you know, I'm, you know, I'm, I like, you know, I like to do as I'm told. Um, uh, yeah. what should we be for Halloween? Have you guys started thinking about it? It's a tough, tough question. I think he should be raising Kane himself. Yeah. Um, did right. I tell you I got mistaken for him? <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm not kidding. Uh, what? I take that as an insult. <laughs> Holy shit. The CEO guy? Why? How? He's like, hello. I, I, I walked my, in. My dog like, came up with this recipe. And I, I walked into one of their locations. Um, like, no way. You're once the CEO. frequently. Fr- <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Freak. Star Wars is real. 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 That's our, that's, for those at home, that's our calm down song. <laughs> it's a bit of a lullaby if, if either of us is freaking yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gets like he gets like he gets he gets like little swirls around his head. It's like the like, it's like calms down the Hulk, you know. Yeah. Uh, no, I walked into one of their locations and. There was like a buzz, and they like were all like, I wouldn't say like shushing and pointing, but I, I was like, that's weird. And then somebody goes, "Are you related to Todd Howard? Or, or not Todd Howard? Ron Howard. Ron Howard. Todd Howard. Todd Howard. He directed a Top Gun. Todd Howard. Todd Howard is the creator of Skyrim. Ron Ron, yes. Ron Howard is the narrator for um, Rest of Development. Well, whatever the CEO of of Kings is, he had his face plastered on some billboards a while ago. I think it was Todd Howard. And I'm like, no. He's, they're like, you look just like him. So give me some free candy. Why like, did you not? Because I don't. Yeah. I don't. I don't know. I don't like the guy. I. I <laughs> um, <laughs> could have gotten free canes. <laughs> <You're> been, absolutely. <laughs> Come on. Uh, That's a sitcom moment for you. No, he's a. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know, I guess I, yeah, I don't know enough to say I, I, against it. I want to say this in no uncertain terms. <laughs> I count <laughs> am calling Todd Howard. <laughs> Raising Kane's chicken fingers. <laughs> Speaking put on the internet. legally, we are just simply accusing him of being 
defamation per se. It doesn't, doesn't matter if it's true. Just the fact that the act of me saying it is defamation. And if any jury is listening to this, you're fucking... Yes, I'm confessing to any and all future crimes. I don't know. I don't think I look like him. But I guess... Well, it sounds like you got your Halloween costume, then. They asked me... No, but I do... I, it, it's gotta hurt to, to, to be... Like, oh, you look like you could run a fried chicken chain. <laughs> With your dog? <laughs> With your dog as vice president? <laughs> okay, if I look up Raising Cane's images, because, I mean... It's, it's from our Raising state. Raising Cane's! Yeah. It's from our state, Ohio. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't have said. Nope. Raising Cane's... I don't have to say mascot. Probably CEO. Todd Graves. There we go. I guess I don't not look like him, but I don't... Yeah, I don't you could definitely be related. I think you could be related. Yeah, I think he's he's kind of an. I still one. it's not as good as Matt Damon, but and a. <laughs> um. Matt Damon also. A yeah. <laughs> him too. <laughs> I'm completely sober in the middle of the day. Accuses a ton of people. Of <laughs> Ugh. Um. You find a Halloween custom though. Yeah. So Halloween has become a. It's fraught a, with problems. A sore subject for me because. <laughs> he made it pizza made a, a noise like he was like oh, oh my god I think he's us. sleeping with his eyes open oh really yeah That's he yeah. does that pizza's making like owl sounds yeah he sounds like he's snoring um, yeah yeah no he's definitely <laughs> sleeping but his eyes are wide open <laughs> it's very creepy when he does it <laughs> it's so weird sometimes he'll do it but like sleeping on your chest and just looking right at you <laughs> and, he, and you're like are you awake he's a weird cat <laughs> um I think he's a cool cat and I mean that in both Two ways. And figurative. Yeah. Um, I thought for sure I was going to be Meatloaf mm-hmm. from Rocky Horror. He has the love and hate on his yeah. knuckles. He's got the the motorcycle uh, helmet. And now I don't think I want to do it anymore. <laughs> yeah. Um, the love and hate. He's got the I'm not going to just be Meat. Like, I would do Meatloaf if everybody was doing a Rocky mm-hmm. Horror thing. But I don't think that's happening. And now I've gone... I've, I've wasted all 11 months. <laughs> and, and in the literally 11th hour uh, I I don't know what to do hmm. this happened last this happened two years ago Ooh. or perhaps three when I was no, Andy no, Warhol I'm just thinking of a cool costume idea for me but continue <laughs> no, I want to hear I want to hear your idea what do you got well since last year I was Bane and that went over swimmingly that yeah. was like that was easily my most successful Halloween costume ever um I'm, I'm thinking you know I'm thinking of like like bald guys, and one of the ideas I had last year was Agent Forty Seven. Oh, that'd be fun. that would be sick. Have the barcode on the mm-hmm. back. Yeah, that, that's pretty and much the to, costume. And yeah. you get to wear a suit. You might have to shave though. Not that you've never shaved before, but are are you willing to to commit? Maybe, like some other bald guy. Who are other famous bald men? Um, Vin Diesel. Um. <laughs> uh, well, Bruce no, Willis. Howie, Howie Mandel. Yeah, Bruce Willis. Bruce Willis said, like with the with like the brown jacket right, when he's like on the motorcycle. Like Zed's Pulp Dead, Fiction. Maybe. That'd Zed's be sweet. Oh, yeah, be a good couples costume. Yeah, well, yeah, um, it would be. You could yeah. be John McClane, but yeah, would be a good couples costume. I got a couple of costumes for you. What clown costumes? I always dreamt, dreamed of like doing like Fallout Power Armor. That'd be sick. But I would, or I would do that for cosplay. You would, would need to learn like seven different skills and become like a pro with them and invest like, <laughs> like hundreds of dollars. of dollars. Yes. But yeah, go for it. Yeah, probably. My yeah. dream costume, which I obviously I could never do, would be Jim Henson. Mm. But I would have to grow a beard for it. Mm. And I obviously can't do that. And have like a Kermit. Like, oh, there's, a, there's a shot of him. Like, yeah. But you guys don't care. Oh, it's a stupid idea. You should go as Jim Croce and grow up. <laughs> I thought you were going to say Jim Crow. <laughs> Jim Second Crow. time he's been featured on this podcast. <laughs> um, Jim Croce would be sick. But not really. A, not really, though. A costume. No, but not really, though. <laughs> yeah, but... <laughs> but that would actually suck as a Halloween costume. Yeah. Um, yeah, I feel like... Bane would just be good every year. Maybe a different just do Bane, Bane again. Yeah, for real. Just, Bane <laughs> just again. do like a different like iteration of him. You did Tom Hardy's Bane, do fucking uh, George Lucas's Bane. Yeah. Um, George Lucas's Bane. 
There is a George, George Lucas being the Darth Bane. Writing. Yeah, it's like writing dialogue. Dialogue, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. Have you thought of any costumes? Um. Yeah, I've been thinking about doing uh, uh, Sigourney Weaver and Rick Moranis from Ghostbusters. That's a good one. Yeah. So like you're just going to do like one half as one mm-hmm. the other half? <laughs> no, Christine would be Rick Moranis. Oh, cute. Uh, with, the, with the salad bowl on his head. Oh. And then the big red. Yeah. Whisper. Yeah, and you got a big old. Ding. Big old. Zool. Big old yeah. Your muff showing. Yeah, I was I was gonna make that joke. Your minge yeah. hair, but I just I, the, the grossest thing ever. Yeah. What, what's that? Oh, Ridley Scott. Um, you saw that those things was making the rounds like that. Meme, oh like, yeah, 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 like, yeah. yeah. Share pubes. But he, he he like the the word he used is like we had to keep cutting her minge hair out, which is which is <laughs> disgusting. I, I don't like the word minge. It's crazy. Um, and I'm just like, oh god, Ridley Scott. I don't really care about you or your movies. Um, I like Ridley Scott's movies, at least the one I saw. I like his I like his games. I play him in Smash. Oh, you almost had uh, me! You almost had uh, me. Maybe it was like a, I don't know, some sort of, I don't know, some sort of like Taliban kind of guy. Yeah, a Taliban sort yeah. of fellow. Yeah, Taliban. Kind you know, of you should you should <laughs> you should have like a you should wear a bunch of towels and then like have like a big like red. With like a circle with a line through it and be like a, a towel band. <laughs> wow. That's like a that's like one of the I don't I, I can't decide if it's dumb or good. Uh, one of my costume ideas and I had in college was like wearing like a like a gray tweed suit, like looking professorial, like little like circle glasses, and tape a bunch of packs of cigarettes to my body and I'd be Sigman Freud. Wow. Ah. That was that was an idea I had one Sigmund time. Freud. Um but yeah. I don't know. I, I, it's clearly never come to pass. So, because um, I'm not in jail. So, what's going on? With it? it was pizza the cat. Pizza's gonna be pizza. Oh, this whole song. Oh, we have a pizza costume. Pool. I'm running out of like pop culture icons that I like. Yeah. Like I'm really. I kind of. Yeah. Maybe this is it. Maybe yeah. this is the end for you. Yeah. Maybe you're done. I think there's not much, <laughs> maybe you can check much, out. I don't think there's not there's not much time left for you. I'm <laughs> going to the great bar in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I was gonna say yeah. Like I'll be gonna... Sam Malone from Cheers. Done. Who right. is that? It's it's Ted Danson. I'm not gonna be him. Oh. It'll be Glenn Danzig. You could jack for it. You hear that story about Glenn Danzig uh, premiering premiering his movie at the Music Box? Was it Baratica? Yeah. Um, he premiered it at the music box and it's like a horror film. But it's like so it terrible. It sucks. Yeah, they talked about it on Half of the Bag or whatever. Oh, really? And um, it should have been on Best of the Worst. Uh, hey, oh. But everybody like in the theater was like laughing during the movie. <laughs> and he came on and was like, well, you guys laughed at a lot of parts you weren't supposed to. So uh, he was like, yeah, he was pissed about it. Um, Jesus Christ. He, maybe he took it in good stride, but I think I think he was not happy with it. Good lord, yeah. At least he didn't have like a meltdown. Only yeah, what only I was good, expecting. Only good musician I can think of. Who Let's like, say he did. He did. He had a crazy meltdown. <laughs> <laughs> he threw a fit in the theater. He was and and I noticed that when he. he t- Say, I was gonna say like a, something fell out of his pocket, and like it was a photo album that unrolled. <laughs> Damn, this is sucks that this is the through line. <laughs> So, oh no! This is our running gag this episode. No, I can't make a thumbnail out of this. <laughs> you can <laughs> once. Yeah. <laughs> oh Jesus! Do you want to be on the nightly news? <laughs> just, just bleep out the word. Yo, rest in peace. Um, yo, uh, rest in peace, Queen Elizabeth. You know. Yeah. Rest in peace. Ah, <laughs> uh, more like. No, I have nothing. <laughs> Yeah, I think um, it's funny. No, there will be no bitch. I, I should go as Queen Elizabeth for, for uh go as Queen Elizabeth, but I like but it's like a gory costume because yeah. I think that I think that it's I like, bet that'll be a thing this year. It's like Queen Elizabeth after her car wreck. Yeah, exactly. I get, I get it mixed up with Princess Diana. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and 
<laughs> and, and Freddie Mercury. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Queen Elizabeth when she was dying of AIDS, but then got into a car accident. Yeah, that, because she was fleeing paparazzi. Allegedly. No, I'm definitely not going to do that for Halloween. Don't worry about that, Dunder Nation. We were looking. Up. Probably going to go as Teddy. No. <laughs> Most popular Halloween you go, costume. You go around with a big sign around your neck that says my full name and address. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> my name is Walter Hartwell White. I live in 1609 North Albuquerque. Oh, maybe I could be, be Walter White. Oh, you Actually, totally that could. Would be sick. That would be so That'd sick. That would be so sick. Yeah, but which Walter White? Do you go Do you go in your tidy whiteies from the pilot? Or Heisenberg? I guess he's not bald there. But yeah, so you go, you could go Heisenberg with that. You could go Heisenberg, hat. you could wear like a, I'm thinking like like a lab I was, coat. I was thinking like the tan jacket with like the mustache and the glasses. Yeah. Like like post chemo Walter when he's yeah. like, when he's going down his dark road. You have even a lot though, of options. Even though I've only watched I've only ever watched one season I watched one season of Breaking Bad years ago and never watched more of it. You probably watched the worst season. I think so. Um that's what everyone says. Though I enjoyed it, um yeah, it just wasn't in the cards for me at the time. Or probably ever again. <laughs> yeah. you, that, well, it's like, it's like I didn't even know. I didn't. Even, I had never watched Dark Knight. Everyone was, everyone was quoting the movie to me last last year. The Halloween. Like, you never seen the Dark Knight Rises? Still haven't. Um, <laughs> what? But, yeah, I still haven't. That's no, awesome. I haven't, I haven't even seen. No, that, yeah. is, that is such chance you know, oh, yeah, yeah, I I No, seriously. I like. I'll be like went to the bar and I was like dressed as Bane, oh, no, and like everyone it. was like, and everyone was like, like I was born in the darkness, and I was like, hell yeah, brother, um, like <laughs> absolutely. Um, that, re- that reminds me of the time when oh my god, we we went uh, up to Wisconsin for Halloween, and we went to that club. Oh yeah, and in there were, there were like a couple people dressed as Joaquin Phoenix Joker. No, I think it was Jared Leto Joker. No, no, it was Joaquin Phoenix. No, it was Jared Leto. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, wow, that there was a lot of girls dressed as Harley Quinn. I forget, what did I? Like the Birds of Prey Harley Quinn. That that brings me to my next point. Um, and I was in the bathroom with the guy dressed up as the Joker. Not just we just both at the same time. We're, we're fucking the same. We're just no, we're just in the urinal. We're we're just, a little bit of we're just both pissing into the urinal simultaneously. That's all. Um, and I guess it was, yeah, we're both pissing nice in, yeah, we're <laughs> in the same urinal in an empty bathroom. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> replace your own little urinal with a uh, small <laughs> You replace Joker with Glenn Danzig. Um, replace with, Todd, with, with Todd Graves. With Todd Graves. <laughs> and you have, uh, and Todd you have tomorrow's news story. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you have the news of tomorrow. <laughs> no, hey. it... Uh, but I asked him to do something. I asked him to say some like Joker line. You asked him to say we live in a society. Oh yeah, I asked him to say we live in a society. He said no, <laughs> and I was like, all right. Nice. Some fucking stranger comes up and and makes fun of your costume. No, it's not me. That's like no. no, that's appreciation. That's the costume. Yeah, you're dressed up as Joaquin Phoenix Joker. You're not going to say we live in a society. Didn't we live in a society come from Jared Leto Joker? No Joker has ever said that. <laughs> it's a meme. <laughs> well, it's from George Costanza. Yeah. Actually, no, Jared Leto did say that in, like, after the meme had come out in a trailer. Yeah, but that's, that's more of a reference. Thing. Another thing, and then it was not, it was cut from the movie. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, we are living in a society. Well, I think, you know what I think it comes from? I think it's somebody made a Joaquin Phoenix Joker know. trailer. It goes Eminem. But it's all set to to you should go to Seinfeld the, the sexy green M&M. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Who is now who is now a, a sexless prude? He yeah. doesn't get any ass. She has no <laughs> penis anymore. No <laughs> penis anymore. Um, they neutered the green. M&M. We were looking up like most popular Halloween costumes by year, and we were trying to figure out someone would give the year, and we were trying to guess the costume. Um. 2015. Harley Quinn. Yeah, it was all Harley Quinn. Um, I think 2008 was the Joker. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm probably going to go with Black Panther. That would be good. Yeah. As the Woman King. Is I that, saw... Are they related? Uh, no. No, but they look so similar. It's like the Woman King is like clearly trying to rip off it, Black Panther. No, it clearly looks like you know they saw Black Panther was successful and then went to like their pile of scripts... I was like, what can we use? And what can we, like, you know, green light that we can then market? Like, Is it fantasy? No, it's it's based on a true story. Oh, gotcha. 
She would call it the queen. The brave fighters of the yeah. Mujar al Din. <laughs> Mujar al Din. What are they called? Mujahideen. The, 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 I was really close. Mu, yeah, you were. You were really remarkably close. close. It's, also, it's also hilarious that, you, that you, the first thing you thought of was the Mujahideen, the, the Afghani Liberation Force. Yes. Like Osama bin Laden. Yes. Who, in retrospect, actually not that bad of a guy. <laughs> if you think about it. Yeah. No, I'd say so. Except for one glaring flaw. He was a p- Breaking news, <laughs> Osama Bin Laden accused of <laughs> <laughs> Will he recover? We go to our panel. We go, we go to London now. For, we go to our panel. For Sir Gordon, Gordon Lightfoot's take on it. Well, I don't, I don't quite see how it's going to be anything. I don't really see how it's going to be anything. The I'm Canadian ready. folk singer Gordon Lightfoot? <laughs> Thank you, Sir Gordon Lightfoot, our BBC correspondent. We're going to go now to Paris to uh, Jean-Jacques Depardieu. Oh, I think that uh, la pedophilie is not a big problem for some of you. Hey, mate, it's me, Gerard Depardieu. I've been hanging around with all of us. Hello, Jack. It's me, Gerard Depardieu. It's an emergency. <laughs> it's an emergency. I'm from Paris, France, I am. Um, you know who I am right now? I'm in a, I'm in a, a right wing movie. I'm the like smarmy podcast guy. Who's getting all these men canceled on like baseless claims? <laughs> and, and my uh, like my internet cronies are are mm. I have I, I and I look like a I look like the the a try fan. guys guy. I think we should get into the the right wing grift of like like and like make some Infowars movies. That'd be so sick. Because they've got so the fun. um they're they they did the the awesome. Uh, Joe Biden's Hunter Biden. Uh, I've heard it's. Have you seen? Have you, oh, I've heard a lot of hilarious. It. Have you seen the the new news that they're making a Malcolm X biopic with a white guy cast yeah. as it? And like everyone, I just saw like everyone on Black Twitter was just like, I li- I no exaggeration, cannot wait to see this. Like, like we're gonna have watch parties. It's so funny to like be try and make a point of too. like recasting. That's so funny. Like <laughs> a, a famous person of color with a white person be like, see, we can do it too. It's like we. But all the famous like people that are being hundreds cast, of movies yeah. like that. But all the people of color like that are being cast as shit are like for like animated characters. And like John, like, John Wayne Gacy was Genghis Khan. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, like what? You, this is already a thing. Like what are you talking about? They should you? have casted an Asian actor as Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> you know, it should have been him killing white people. <laughs> no, oh my no, god! No, no, no. That should that would not have been a good idea. <laughs> yeah, actually, I think they shouldn't have done that. Would have been rather naughty. I actually don't, don't think that would be a really sub- actual. We should get a yet. subscription to that like right wing Netflix with all the Gina Carano movies. I yeah, info. Wars. She's in the movie. Is that what she's, she's in? Yeah, she's she plays like she has like two bodies. Are like info streams or whatever? Not yeah. info wars go. No. Whatever that whatever the platform is that they use. The, but we should yeah we could make Netflix. We should know we should print. Yeah, she killed them. she killed our main. Episode of oh yeah, thing. God! She <laughs> sent that to the fucking moon. It's so, it's, and it's funny because we spent like a half hour of it talking about how much we love her politics. Yeah, <laughs> and then she had to come out. Um.